Hello guys and welcome back to Green Nation. Today we're going to do a draft uh, NFL round one to the 2021 NFL draft. I'm not a pro at draft. I've watched one or two videos of a mock draft, so I kind of have an idea of what to do. I don't really watch college football. Maybe over my life I've watched like 10 minutes of it. So yeah, so Jets are definitely going to take Trevor Lawrence. Justin Fields is going to go to the Jaguars, no doubt. The Bengals need to protect Joe Burrow, no matter what they do. Sorry if the logo's not popping up, something's happening. Because uh, Patrick Sturden, he needs to go. The Cowboys need help on the corner on their defense. Defense is horrible. Chargers need um, Gregory Rosai. Melvin Ingram's not under contract next year. Then you get contain Patrick Mahomes. And Joey Bosa's getting hold. And then the Eagles are going to take Jamal Chase and need wide receiver help. I know they need an offensive lineman, but I don't care who's at quarterback. They need a wide receiver. I don't think they would reach down to get Wyatt Davis. That's the next offensive lineman on the board. And that's at 14. So did they trade down with the Washington football team or they stay there and pick him? So then the Panthers will take their quarterback of the future, Zach Wilson. He's really good. I think he would be really good with Christian McCaffrey. The Falcons will take Micah Parsons. If he's on the board, he's way too good of a player to pass up on. They need defense help, too. I mean, that Alucon person is really good, but they need another one, too. And, he, and Michael Parsons really good at rushing. And then the Dolphins are going to take Jim Waddle. They need wide receivers. Devante Parker is not as more of a can't like get open. He's more of a jump ball receiver. And the Broncos will take care of Foley. They need uh, cornerback helps. And again, like the whole AFC West, they need help on defense to stop Petrimo. And then uh, Washington football team is taking Trey Lance. They will also need a wide receiver. We could take Devonta Smith or Terrace Marshall, like any wide receiver, but they can get that some of those better wide receivers in the second round too. And so... Um, the Lions, they're taking Devontae Smith. Need help. Mm, Kenny Galladay is not going to be, is not on the contract, but he's probably going to come back. Marvin Jones, you know, he's good, but I don't think he's going to be back next season. The Bears take Wyatt Davis. They need offensive linemen. The next QB is not, is pretty far down the board. 49ers, though, like I said, they the Wyatt Davis, the Bears pick uh, Wyatt Davis over him. 49 are going to take Kyle Trask now. He's, I think he would be good in the Kyle Shanahan thing, playbook. Cardinals take Kyle Pitts. They need a playmaker for him. For Kyle Murray, other than they can't just run read options all day like the Ravens do. I mean, Larry Fitzgerald is getting old. He's gonna, he can retire any time now. And then DeAndre Hopkins, I mean, he's really good, but they need another playmaker, and they're not that good at tight end. Patriots, they take... Um, wide receiver, they take Rashad Bateman. They need wide receiver. I have, in the second round, I have them taking Mac Jones. I think they should take him. He's a pocket passer just like Tom Brady. So I think that would fit uh, Bill Belichick. The Ravens would take Alex Leatherwood. They need, they're need they more of a running team, so they need him. And protect Lamar Jackson. The Raiders will take Quiddy Pay. He's really good. If he's on the board, they should take him. Gotta contain Patrick Mahomes. Keep him in the middle of the pocket. I mean, he's really good anywhere, but if you keep contain him on the edge, you have a good chance of not of him not completing the pass as much. But you also have to get pressure up the middle. And then the Giants are going to take Sean Wade. James Bradbury is doing really good, but he's a veteran. He's getting older, and they need someone else opts in. But their defense has been doing really good this year. The Vikings will uh they can, I don't think they reached them for quarter quarterback. They have a good wide receiver. Wide receivers are done. Wide receiver, running backs are done. So I think they take either Creed Humphrey or Co Samuel Cosme. But I think they're gonna take Samuel Cosme. And then the Buccaneers they need an inside offensive lineman. They got the offensive tackle last year, and what's his name? I forgot his name already, but. I mean, he's really he's been really good. He's been one of the best. And uh, now they need a, a the now they picked uh Jalen Waddle with the first pick, and then now they're gonna pick 
Dylan Moses, they need a linebacker. And that can that will really help him. Dylan Moses has been falling though because he opted out. And then the Colts will take they can't get a quarterback reaching. They already have their running back. I mean, I guess they need a wide receiver. But I think they would rather take a um tight end. Pat Fryermath. He's I think he's pretty good. And they need some tight end help there. The they the no the Titans will definitely take College Basham. He's really, really good. Well, based off of what people are saying on YouTube, but yeah, he looks I guess he sounds really good. And they need like Vic Beasley's not good and he just does good one year, gets money and then stops playing good at all. And then Jadavian Clowney has zero sacks he's on IO. The Jets? So the Jets will get a wide receiver they need to help him, help Trevor Lawrence if they pick him. So they'll get Rondell Moore. He's he's very good in open field. Jaguars will take Karis Marshall. Actually, I mean, I don't think they would take a, a lineman here. Other than Christian Bryce, I mean, they need... I mean, actually, the Jaguars actually have them take that... Because they have good wide receivers. They have Lavis Cushenal and DJ Chalk, which are really good. They're both wide receiver one cal uh caliber players. The Browns will take a uh, defensive lineman, Christian Balmore. They have some few linemen going uh in the free agency. They're not gonna be able to resign all of them. At first I had them taking a wide receiver. There's Marshall's there, but now I think they would rather take a lineman offensive tackle this, but this Jalen Mayfield's good. Or a running back. But yeah, this is a hard one here. Maybe a tight end, but let's look at the thing. Corn yeah, I think they need a corner. They have Trey Davis White, they need someone else there to solidify solid for that position. Packers, they have, they don't need a running back. Jeff Patterson's really good. I think he can be a second rounder, even a first rounder, if he keeps going up on his pace. I think he had like 409 rushing yards and eight touchdowns, based off of what I've seen, heard. And the Packers, they got um, Jordan Love for no reason last year. And Aaron Rodgers is still in his prime. So I think they get Terrace Marshall to help him out, help him out. And now the Chiefs, Terrence Marshall goes right off the board right before them, so I don't think he'll get him. They'll take an offensive line, they gotta protect him. Inside, they need inside offensive line, so I think, I don't think they go Trey Smith. I think Elijah Vera Tucker's way better, based on what people are saying. So in the Saints, interesting one, I don't think they would reach for a quarterback. They have tight ends, wide receivers set. I mean, the wide receivers, they could take one, like Oman Ross St. Brown. I, but Jeremiah uh, Ovu thing person's good, really good. The Steelers, they'll definitely take a um lineman, or they could take running back. I guess yeah. Let's have them take Travis Etienne. That ends our mock draft. One now in mock draft. Like again, I'm not good at this at all. I don't really watch college football. But yeah, so don't hate on me and don't get triggered because I'm so bad at this. So yeah, I hope you guys like enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe, like the video, and share it if you want. So yeah, guys, see you guys next time. Bye.